how to create captions or subtitles in Premiere Pro. Go to the project window, go down to the new item menu, click captions. I usually change this to open captions. That's right for my sequence, so I'll leave it as it is, but change it if you need to for your sequence. Click OK, and there we have open captions. You can then drag this down to your timeline. I then like to drag it out as long as I need it. The next thing you need to do is find the captions window. This is sometimes already active in your Premiere Pro software, but sometimes it isn't, so you need to go into Windows and find captions. There we have captions. Now when I click on the captions that is in the timeline, we have this box appear. So we can start typing in our captions. So if we were doing this for a voiceover, it may be, hello, my name is Tom. We want that from zero to three seconds. We add the next caption. I am editing this video for YouTube. The, oh, and I've messed it up there. We go back to captions, click that up. The next section is how to adjust the timings. So we have three little sections there from zero to three, three to four, four to five. So you can increase and decrease the length of those on here. It won't let me at the minute because three is in the way. The easiest way I've found to do it is go down to the sequence, use the plus key so you can see more on that. And then using the arrow tool, you can move the bits of text to where you need them to go to. So let's say we want that one over there, that one there, and we want this one a little bit longer. We want this one to put up to that one, and we want this one to put up to there. So there we go. And now we have captions, subtitles, very easy way to do it. Now we can see that these have moved to the top of the screen. Why is that? Because in the captions menu, you can see that one, we can tell it we want it to go down there. We want that one also to be down there, and we want this one to also be down there. This represents the quadrants of the screen. So now when we go back, they are in the correct place. So that is how to create captions or subtitles in Premiere Pro.